How in the world does water get to the Tri Valley? Approximately 70% of water used in the Tri Valley is imported from outside our region. How in the world does it get here? Our journey begins at one of the highest points in California, in the beautiful Sierra Nevada mountains. Snow falls here, becoming snowpack each winter. In the spring, that snow melts and begins our water's journey through Feather Falls. The freshly melted water flows over the falls and down into Lake Oroville, a precious reservoir for our state's water system. When it is needed, the California Department of Water Resources releases water through the Oroville Dam into the Feather River. Water travels along the Feather River for over a hundred miles through Northern California into the Sacramento River, continuing until it finally reaches the Sacramento-San Joaquin Delta. Commonly known as the California Delta, Bay Delta, or simply the Delta, this is a key fork in the road for our state water project system, where water begins to diverge in different directions. 29 water agencies across the state of California are direct beneficiaries of the state water project. Water coming to the Tri-Valley is pumped from the Delta into the California Aqueduct. Water from the California Aqueduct flows into Bethany Reservoir, where it can be pumped into the South Bay Aqueduct. The South Bay Aqueduct is a series of man-made pipes and channels that brings most of our water into the Tri-Valley. Water flows another 40 miles along the South Bay Aqueduct into the Tri-Valley, starting at Patterson Pass Reservoir. Some water is treated there and begins its journey to do a world of good in our homes and businesses. During wet years, Zone 7 stores excess surface water in groundwater banks that can be used during dry years. Some water continues another 10 miles onto Lake Del Val. Lake Del Val is another reservoir that holds the majority of our surface water until we need it. Then it is treated at our larger treatment facility, Del Val Water Treatment Plant. From the peaks of the Sierra Nevada to the heart of the Tri Valley, water travels over 200 miles on this wondrous journey before beginning the treatment process that makes it safe for our use. Learn more about the wondrous world of water at trivalleywater.org.